The Rolling Hills Zoo in Salina is drawing attention from around the world after an endangered species gives birth to rare twins. Cake's Brian Ramsdale gives us a behind the scenes look at the babies and their protective mother. The two calves are laid down right now. The mom right there looking at me, she's telling me not to get too close. We really kind of won the jackpot with it. Rolling Hill Zoo curator Peter Bervinich is excited. We're just calling them number one and number two at the moment. <laughs> this addicts, a type of antelope, was born on Sunday, and then there was a surprise that caught everyone off guard. After the first birth, uh, we were expecting her to be finished, we, and then all of a sudden, about 20 minutes later, all of a sudden, a, a second set of hooves appeared. A twin birth is something that's just an even more grand experience. It's something we didn't expect to see. The addicts is hunted for its prized antlers, now nearly extinct. They can only be found in zoos and wildlife sanctuaries. Bervinich says they are the only zoo in the nation to have twins that have survived this long, and those babies are bringing in the crowds. Oh, I had the day off today and brought my son. From what I can see, they're really little. <laughs> a lot of people are coming up to take a look at it. You know, you're probably not going to see this uh, anytime soon. We're told the best time to come out here and see these calves is early in the morning or late in the afternoon. Whenever it's really cool out, that's when they're usually most active. Reporting near Salina, I'm Brian Ramsdale, Cake News. Adorable. And the zoo is waiting for the babies to mature before they name them. And they're considering allowing the public to pick a name.